January 10th, 1999. An unforgettable day for Jerry Schutz, the day his partner, Will Hendrick, went missing. He was pretty much the light of my life. The two were together for five years, up until the night Will went missing from a party 23 years ago in Moscow, Idaho. Will was declared murdered when his skull was found three and a half years later in the woods of eastern Lataw County. His killer has yet to be brought to justice. He would help anyone out. He was one of those kind of people. He'd do anything for you. And then there was the theater party, and, and that's where it all went off the rails. Right now, I'm sitting on the steps of the stairs that went up to the second floor party 23 years ago on January 10th, 1999. This apartment building was the last place Will was seen alive. But those kids at that party, they were, they were broken. Heartbroken after realizing they may never see their friend alive again. Will's car was found parked downtown one week after he was reported missing. It was this parking spot here. His work keys still inside, mud caked on the wheels, and some other key details only someone like Jerry could have noticed. I remember when I got into the car, the seat was back as far as it could go. Will war drove with the steering wheel right up into his lap. So somebody who wasn't Will had driven that car that day or, um, you know, moved it. Both the driver and passenger window to the car had been rolled down approximately a couple of inches. It was a winter's night in Idaho, so when that cold air seeped through the cracked windows, any possible fingerprints that could have been used for evidence were washed away. We should have been able to solve this, that, that, that this, this was not an unsolvable crime. Wayne Rausch was the lead investigator of Will's case in 1999 for Lataw County. Somebody needs to pay for it. 23 years after his murder, Moscow PD continues to receive tips and leads about Will, but tackling a cold case is never an easy task. We always believe that uh, there's always that one piece of evidence that will tie everything together, or um, somebody knows something. We believe somebody knows something out there. At the time, a number of possible suspects were looked into, including a truck driver who lived in the same trailer court as Jerry and Will. The truck driver definitely knows something. He left town the same morning that Will disappeared in a refrigerated truck. However, the truck driver left on work business, and that was confirmed by his employer. Although there was another suspect, a hitchhiker the truck driver picked up from Texas, who has a suspicious background. He had been working at an old folks home in Texas. He had been fired because he uh, hated gays. And because Will was gay, Roush believed he and the hitchhiker had an unfortunate meeting ultimately leading to Will's murder. In the end, that belief never could be physically proved. What I can prove in court and what I honestly believe in my heart of hearts are obviously two different things. Today, Jerry decides to move on with Will's memory in the best way he knows how, through Will's love for theater. Every time I get on stage, I think of Will and thank him for giving me the audacity to get up and pretend like I know what I'm doing. Reporting in Moscow, Idaho, Ava Wainhouse, Murrow, News 8.